This is legit the fourth time that I'm filming this review. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Mario, also known as Soul Style Beauty. I know you haven't seen me in a hot, hot minute. Things have been crazy busy with like schoolwork, grad school, work, like you know the business. So I am reviewing a new product today. This is a new foundation which I have on right now. And we're gonna learn more about it in this video. But this is the newest of new foundation that Maybelline came out with. And this is the Maybelline Super Stay Full Coverage Foundation. This is a full coverage foundation. It is oil free. It's supposed to be lightweight. It promises 14 hours of wear. And most importantly, it's affordable. I only got this foundation for $9.99 from Walmart.com. And one thing that I love about this is I feel like they took in consideration undertones which is a great big thing for like drugstore foundations so I'm so happy to try it um so this is more so like a try on video showing you guys how I use the product rather than like a wear test because I'm not going anywhere today I'm in the shade 355 coconut and also uh this is like a warm undertone I would say like a red a red undertone more so like than that golden red that I like I feel like this will be workable so today I'm just gonna be doing a try on talking a little bit more about the claims and so on uh, so let's get into this video but today I'm gonna be doing a review on the Maybelline super stay foundation this is the newest of new foundations um, and it's the talk of the time right now in the beauty community so this is a full coverage foundation and Maybelline claims that it has 14 hour wear it's oil free and it's also lightweight although that it, although it's full coverage which I feel like is really really good um, so yeah today I'm gonna be wearing uh, this and doing like a try on test um, basically just trying on this foundation just to show you guys how bomb it is so yeah the reason why I usually stray away from drugstore foundations is because they don't consider undertones they really don't so the darker you are for the most part they think that you're orange and I'm just like eh, I, I'm not wearing that so I usually buy like my or NARS because they do consider uh, undertones and they are of quality products so usually I spend like $50 on a NARS or a Lancome product but this Maybelline foundation is only $9.99 I purchased it from Walmart so yeah and it has a pump so go Maybelline I'm gonna pump one pump out a foundation and put it on one side of my face and we're gonna see how this plays out nice finish to it. I like that. That's very nice. I didn't even use a full pump. I was like, eh, it's too much. Okay, so looking at this, it... <sighs> It reminds me of kind of like uh, Fenty Beauty that it has that blurring effect and I feel like this foundation definitely has that blurring effect similar to Fenty Beauty. Um, I would say that the undertone is a quite bit red. I wish that they would have mixed a little bit of yellow undertone so it's that golden red. Um, my undertone which would be perfect but the thing is it's workable and they tried. That's what we ask friends to do is to try so I'm glad that they tried. Um, but it's workable for me. It's not perfect, perfect, but I mean, what in the world is, you know, <laughs> basically. So I am going to put foundation on, actually, let me show you guys what this side looks. I'll only put this on a little bit. So side with no foundation, side with foundation. Once again, no foundation and a side with foundation. So I'm just going to finish this out on this side and put on foundation I'm not trying to be wasteful <laughs> okay so I'm gonna blend this out let's see how this looks right now I feel like this is really impressing me like just like Maybelline claimed like it's lightweight I can definitely say that this is like weight. I don't feel like this. I, I feel like cake face. I have things like it's heavy 
on my face. I do say that this is a matte foundation. It's not dewy in any way. This is a matte foundation, which I love. I look for matte foundation, not dewy foundation, because I have oily skin. Um, but if you, <laughs> the finish is absolutely beautiful. I really, really like it. So good job, Maybelline. Really, really nice job. Right now, I'm just gonna put on a concealer. It's just gonna be a very simple look. And then I'm going to set my entire face with the Laura Mercier Translucent Powder in Medium Deep. Like I said, I don't want to do too much because I feel like I want to see how the product works. I don't want to, you know. I love the color though. I feel like they did such a good job. Maybe Lancome and NARS won't be getting my coins. I mean, if I'm spending $10 on this. Very, very good. Um, great. And then I am going to add some highlighter. This is the Jackie Ina highlighter in La Peach. It is the business. It is the business. So yeah, this is all that I'm going to do, but this is just like a try on video to show you how bomb this foundation is. Like I'll even do a close up so you guys can see, but the foundation is so good and it's only $9.99. Um, I really wanted to get this video out so I cannot do a wear test because I'm not going anywhere today. Um, but I can update you guys more so on my blog. I'm also going to be doing a blog post about this. So if you aren't subscribed to the mailing list, www.soulsoftbeauty.com, go on that website and sign up for the mailing list. And I'll be talking more about it. But here I was just like, I want to just show how the product works and how it looks. And Maybelline did such a good job on this product. I am in the shade 355 Coconut. And it wears, it looks really, really good. I can even swatch it like on my chest. Like I said, I just wish that it was a little bit. Actually, that doesn't look bad. It actually blended out really nicely. Wow. I feel like that was perfect, honestly. This is definitely so sloppy approved. I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching this video, for subscribing to me. If you are not subscribed, then you need to subscribe now. Turn on your notifications so you never, ever miss a video. And I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.